Hello everyone, this is Kevin again, and today I'm going to show an implementation of the TF-IDF algorithm to answer queries. Um, basically, this algorithm finds the term frequency of a word in a query times the natural log of the total number of documents divided by the number of documents containing the word, and it uses this to narrow down which document to look in, and then once it's found a relevant document, it will find the relevant sentence to our query. So, Let's run the program, and let's say I ask it, uh, what are the different types of supervised learning? And as you can see, it answered types of supervised learning algorithms include active learning, classification, and regression. And we can try this again. So uh, we can ask it, when was Python 3.0 released? And it gave me a short, succinct answer right there. And I can ask again, how do neurons connect in a neural network? And it says neurons of one layer connect only neurons of the immediately preceding, immediately following layer. So these are all relevant answers now. Now it doesn't always give me relevant answers. Let me see if I can try this a few more times. So. Um, so let's do, how do I calculate the variance of a standard normal distribution? So that's a mathematical question. As you can see, probability is one of our Wikipedia articles we're searching through. So program to calculate the factorial of a positive integer. So here the answer is not really quite quite relevant. It just, uh, this program basically, using the TF-IDF function, it pretty much just gets uh, like uh, the most relevant article first and then the sentence with uh, the highest IDF value. So this answer is not so relevant, but let's try this again. Let's say if I do, uh, what is variance? And how do I calculate it? Okay, so this is a little bit more relevant. The mean standard error on validation set can be used as an estimate for variance. So yeah, that's pretty good. And we can also try something like, uh, what are the uses in, for artificial intelligence in society? Oh, okay, so um, we have here basically, uh, instead of giving me uses for artificial intelligence, it basically uh, pretty much um, showed how artificial uh, intelligence can be modeled after neurons. So not quite a relevant answer again, Um, let's say I ask it, uh, what is gradient descent? Okay, so we have an answer here. Uh, the weight updates can be done via stochastic gradient sense or other methods, blah, blah, blah. And obviously gradient descent shows up here. Um, and it basically, sh uh, this answer, this answers a question of how our weights updated, which is basically very close to what gradient descent is. So this is an almost very relevant uh, answer. So once again, this is an implementation of the TF-IDF uh, algorithm. Um, there are probably other ways to make it more per pertinently answer uh, the question I query it, including uh, actually looking at the grammatical structure of uh, my query. But yeah, this is a simple, um, this is a pretty simple uh, algorithmic approach and it did give me some good uh, results, so.